this is like a pure offshore boat. We actually had a lady falling asleep there. <laughs> finishing, the finishing is just amazing. We finally trained our dog to go for a week outside. We have oars I mean, as well. Yeah. <laughs> we can sit here for the next two, two weeks probably. Yeah. <laughs> Don't uh -oh. Sounds like Nikki likes it. <laughs> Kia ora everybody, thanks for tuning in. Hey, before we start the video, I wanted to give you a bit of a backstory, as this is not your typical boat review. As you can see, we're at the Auckland on the Water Boat Show, which is like Christmas time for any boatie who loves seeing the latest gear and swapping yarns. This year was extra special, however, as we got to meet Isabel and Sasha, who kindly invited us onto their brand new Surtees 800 Game Fisher to give us an honest owner's review and to demonstrate the latest model from Mincota. What started as a boat review turned into an awesome afternoon of laughter and hearing the story behind this boat build and what it means to them. We loved our time getting to know these guys and their passion for their newly completed boat was infectious. We hope you enjoy watching it as much as we enjoyed making it. Kia ora everybody, we're out here with uh, Sasha from BLA and Isabel from Surtees Boats on their brand new 800 uh, Game Fisher. Thank you so much for having us on. Becky's here too, she's made herself very comfortable in that seat. <laughs> <laughs> We actually had a lady falling asleep there <laughs> yeah. uh, yesterday. See, yeah, yeah, yesterday yeah. on the demo, we had the heater going, yeah. and she was just like sitting there, and the boys were talking about the Minkota and all the technical. Yeah. Really passionate, yeah. and she was just like, yeah, Gone. she was from Cairns, oh. I think. She was yes. flying for ten hours to hold it. Yeah. Well, what yeah. did that say about that? Yeah, yeah. 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 right. Fantastic. I'm saying that I was a bit dusty from the night before, so I was in the cabin really asleep. There we go. So, <laughs> and I didn't, I didn't even realize. I didn't even realize. I found her there, and she's sleeping there. <laughs> yeah. And suddenly he was like, Isabel, Isabel, you need to get up. We are going on the plane. Yeah, right? yeah. Uh, okay. That was funny. Oh, funny. Good. Yeah. So yes, it is a very comfortable boat. Yeah. <laughs> so you've, you've just finished building it. Yes. And yep. um, and I want if we can have a bit of a walk through in a minute to see some of the, the features and stuff. You've already showed us the new new Mincota up the front. But um, what else are you proud of? What, your uh, your favourite feature, I suppose. Oh, it's just the the, the complete boat. The finishing, the finishing is just amazing. It's just it doesn't feel like a bare aluminium boat anymore. It's pretty much like um, yeah. yeah, you have the vinyl on top. You don't have carpet anymore. You have the um, welds are just absolutely the welds, amazing. They have done a um, great job with it. Yeah, those bifold doors change. This is so cool. Everything yeah. because. Yes. It's seriously like we, we had the 700 and it had that little door in the middle and it's fine like it's absolutely doing the job but when you suddenly have enclosed and out <laughs> oh. yeah it is Here cold water, <laughs> it's cold water. <laughs> someone's jumped in over here yeah. <laughs> or fallen in by the sound of it yeah. but so Look at this. you actually really can when you close it all up it's definitely so you can completely close it and it just feels, it's still, it still doesn't feel cramped yeah. because it's full glass and um, pretty much for overnight it's perfect and especially when we are for tuna in winter time you know to Waiau Bay um, and when it's getting a little bit colder weather and yeah and you open it up and basically you have an open boat again. Yes and that's um, just, that's probably one of my favourite things. Yeah. Also what I already said is when we go for tuna I want to fold the bed down and then just pretty much lay here yeah. in the wall, have the heater going, yeah. and then just watch the Lord. Yeah. 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 That's, that's a lot right. of you, eh? Sitting in that seat. Yeah. yeah. That's your view. Imagine. Here we it. go. That's the one. Yeah, um, so we have two light bay tanks, which is actually um, quite cool. Um, basically, yeah, batteries are in in here completely sealed compartment, oh, wow. which is basically, yeah, we've got two house batteries. And one start, which is basically for yeah the long overnight trips, and um, is yeah, that, heaps of space. Is that for the Minkota as well, or are they? No, the that's again? only for okay. the, the motor and uh, for the start and the house batteries. Cool is yeah. also that, so, yeah. like really that with the with the cage around here and having that duck board there. We finally trained our dog to go for a week outside oh, rather than paddling oh. oh. to the yeah, next no, island. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, no, that's, that's really handy to have that out there. Yeah. And so you've just mentioned the 500 litre fuel tank, which yep. is fantastic for long range cruising. Yep. Not so fantastic when you um, at the petrol station. The first time. <laughs> but a little bit painful there. Yep. But with the mercury on the back, I'd imagine you wouldn't be uh, filling up too often. Pretty, oh, pretty... It is, it is. We have oars I mean, as well. About <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got the electric motor. That's why you got the Minn Kota, right? Yeah. Nothing to do with fishing. Exactly. It's a safe no, but it's, it's an 8 metre boat, so it's definitely it's thirsty, but um, it's actually not too bad, you know? Yeah. It's, yeah. 
and um, yeah, but otherwise, pretty much we got Usually you have two this chili boat. bins, they, they go underneath here, we're yeah. just taking them out for the show, so if you're sitting here, you have your, your support for your feet, Absolutely. so that comes also standard. That boat actually has extremely many standard features, like this whole thing is standard, the upholstery, the table is standard, the VHF, the drum winch, the full paint, like all of this is just standard in the package, Yeah. so yeah. that's actually, yeah, that's pretty... Heaps of storage room and this is just important because um, most of the time you're taking out mates and yeah. you have 20 mm. fishing rods on there, you have um, a, a full beer. fridge, a, yeah, yeah. And a lot of beer. Um, yeah. 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 The rocket, wine. Launch, yeah. rocket launch has got about a hundred bloody things Oh yeah, there, hey. <laughs> yeah. And also like yeah. when you're climbing up there, yeah, you see a double double rocket launcher yeah. on the top there. Oh. We put extra some sea deck on the roof oh. so basically yeah. you can also... I'll come out so I don't want to end up with that person who just fell in the water ah. over there. If you scream yeah. like that, yeah. it would be yeah. funny. Yeah. No, but um, we changed our fishing style completely. Like this is like a pure offshore boat, um, and um, we came from a seven meter, which was still a right uh, or six meter boat was the first yeah. one, yeah. Yeah. Um, but now it's pretty much set up for game fishing, which is just what we want to do now. Yeah. Um, and it's also we just go Friday after work. Yeah. And we come home Sunday lunchtime. And the nice thing is because previously with the six meter, we left at four a.m. in the morning, and, and we I came home at eleven p.m. at night, yeah. and you still need to fill it and wash and clean yeah. and now it's just like you stay out there it's comfortable it's nice you come home around lunchtime and you have all afternoon yeah. to actually get everything done so you don't have to wake up at four o'clock in yeah. the morning oh, that's, that's just that like, alone's yeah. worth the price yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's just like yeah yeah so obviously with, with bla you've got the electronics package here talk yes. us through that because i've just noticed you've got two different brands here what well, that's um yeah, so, there? so we um, um, opted like for the Simred. Um, a Simred is just the autopilot is connected. Um, basically, we have, yeah, the full rundown, we have a connected uh, to a one kilowatt, um, which gives us basically everything for our deep dropping experience, you know, deep water. And, but then the Hummingbird is connected to the Mincoder. Okay. Um, just turn it on. Yeah. Um, it probably needs like a couple of seconds. seconds. Yeah. But what it does basically, we can set um, like spot block or heading holds, drift holds, and actually control that from the unit. So normally we just fish here, you know, like whatever for blue nose or something, you know, and you can just um, control everything from the screen, which is perfect because you do not have to run all the Go time and, yeah, inside. Yes. Awesome. Can I just point um, out the whole time we've been here talking, that thing's been holding us here. Now, yeah. before we started filming, that was quarter of an hour and it's just <laughs> you forget actually it's almost like having the anchor down yeah, yeah. exactly yeah. exactly yeah no it's pretty quiet as well and um and we have yeah, charged the batteries and sasha's out with people during the boat show all the time and how much battery is left because um it, how much battery it's still left, the actually. it's still the battery charge from when did the show start thursday wow so one charge so that's yeah that's incredible yeah. And he's yeah. using it really a lot when he's so, coming out there. You saw before three and a half knots steaming out oh, here just I on the Minn Kota. Yeah. Follow with the motor going. Yeah. So this is the 36 okay. volt battery for nice. the Minn Kota. Yeah. Yeah. It's nice and centered. And then we have an app which we can connect it to. And now the comes oh, out. Yeah. There we go. No, no, no. You want just want to. Yeah. You're really <laughs> asking for it. Love gadgets. I love gadgets. Oh yeah. Here we go. Once it's connected. Here we go. And 52 percent. So over it's still. Thursday with people running Thursday, out every the whole time day. and it's oh, still got 50 percent. Yeah, right? but it hardly draws any, I mean we have hardly any wind so it draws 0.8 amp an hour so we can sit here for the next two, two weeks probably. Have <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got a few I'm beers on board? Let's try it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think one of yeah. my favourite features of, of this boat is that the, you just showed with the doors, yeah. you know, you can yeah. shut it all up and have it open. And then you've got this like central area here, you've got the cooker, sink, it's like it's or an actual weekender. Yeah, correct. Yeah. Um, so the diesel heater, basically, when it's down, it's a diesel heater. I see. And if it's like up, it's a cooker. Okay. And um, and actually, it's a pretty simple principle, and you don't have to muck around with gas anymore and everything. So you just open it up, and here's your so little diesel little container. diesel tank. And oh, we filled it once for the last. When, when did we start? Two yeah. weeks ago. Yeah. So it hardly uses yeah. any diesel. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't smell as well, which is great. I mean, it, well, yeah. I think we still want to fit, and I think it comes normally standard with the bolt is the hot water shower. Yeah. So that definitely usually isn't part of the package, but because we scaled it down a bit and got went like, okay, we need to save here and there a little bit, and um, but that would go in the side here, 
and then we just start, we'll, we'll definitely add that soon. And I possibly really want to clip here so you can clip it up here. So after a dive, you can just like yeah. go and have a, have here a shower. Here we go. Yeah, now she's talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's oh, happening, it's it. happening. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I love yeah. Yeah. Oh, just the custom ability you can add. You know, add it, add it later too. That's, exactly. That's cool. And that's yeah. very, very often the case, eh, that you just like build a bolt and then you just go, okay, now we need to pay other bills and yeah. then we can add bits and pieces when, when we but, need it. So yeah, as soon as winter lot. comes, I will, that, that shower will have okay. priority. Yeah, that'll come up the list a bit. Yeah. yeah. So without stating the obvious size difference, you've come up from the 700, was yep. it? And yep. then you had a 6... 610 six, ten before. 610 yep. before, yep. yeah. What else? What else do you notice that's different? Like, obviously the size, but like it's the width. The width, the width. makes okay. a massive this, difference. Yeah. Yeah. And just sitting very comfy, yeah. like yeah. on Having the table. Having dinner and, with four yeah. people. On just yeah. sitting here yeah. is just next level. Or just having your coffee in the morning. And when we went to Lake Rotowiti with my parents, it was pissing down. And we were just sitting here with our coffees. Yeah. The rods were in the water. So we looked cool. out. Yeah, and it was, it was, it was absolutely fine. Yeah, so that yeah is it was good. That is a huge plus. Just like a you know an RV on the water. Yeah, you know? yes. that's that's what yeah. it is, and yeah. it's yeah. It's like the ultimate it's, the hybrid is, like comfort and fishing. Yes, yeah. as well. Exactly. Because you don't uh -oh. sacrifice. Sounds like on Mickey likes space, it. Space, you still have heaps and heaps of yes. space. Yeah. So much space out the back. Okay. And even Big the cabin. Do we underestimate how comfortable it is, and also how like. You would squeeze, or I always squeeze underneath that shelf. Yeah. I fit yeah. perfectly yeah. underneath that shelf, yeah. and they the other person on the, the other shelf, and the person in the middle is just lucky yeah. it has all the room in the middle. And then the dog squeezes in usually as well. <laughs> and then up here, when you fold all of this yeah. down, and, and then you, you have the other person here sleeping here. Mm. One negative is probably like the fridge is sometimes not enough. You know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we yeah. tried yeah. yeah. that yeah. too. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
it's so good that um, yeah, you can take a four meter. We were talking about these other people that took a four meter boat, was it? Yeah, four and a half. Yeah, four and a half. Yeah, yeah. With yeah. a little tent and um, and overnighted on it, which we all know you can do. Yeah. But then you step on something like this and you go, yeah, those luxuries are actually pretty nice, and you can spend more than one night because one night under a tent might be okay, but a week, you know, I think yeah. you'd be um, you'd be looking for some creature comforts, yeah. and this has just got so many. Yeah. Comfort. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Becky, can you work a bit harder? <laughs> And um, we're going to buy one. Yeah, yeah, sign me up. <laughs> sign, yeah, sign me, there you go, you heard yeah. it here first. You're going to, you, you build. Awesome. Hey, thank you so much, guys. So good. We really appreciate you, um, A, taking us out, yeah. but B, talking us through it. Oh, and, um, yeah. We yeah. love talking about yeah. it. Oh, how could you not? This is, yeah, this is talking awesome. about passion, you know? Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Stay tuned, everybody. We're definitely yeah. going to get these guys on for a podcast because yeah. we've spent about 90% of this time talking with the camera off just chatting. <laughs> and, uh, this would be so good to talk about. Yeah. But, um, yeah, thank you yeah. so much, guys. Yeah. We really appreciate it. Oh, good. No, thank you. You might need to do that podcast out at May or something, eh? Oh, yeah, yeah there we go. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Hey, that's what I like these people, mate. <laughs> Oh, Christian, you're busy that weekend. Sorry, mate. <laughs> <laughs>